obviously a dry eye disease uh, it could be managed very easily by a simple uh, eye drops which uh, most patient uh, have used uh, when they go to see your optician or attending their GP practice or even seeing general ophthalmologist. When it comes to seeing a specialist in dry eye disease, we have other modal treatment for those patients who don't respond to the, they would just call it the first line of treatment. Uh, usually we, we, we start by a, a conservative treatment, some uh, uh, eye drops, which are like artificial eye drops to lubricate the eye surface. We teach you modalities how to, to improve the environment around your eyes. A treating meibomian gland uh, dysfunction, which is a disease of the oily glands in the eyelids, that is a key uh, element in managing a dry eye disease. Uh, all these steps will make something like 60, 70, 60 or 70 percent of patients uh, much better. However, you still got that 20, 30 percent of patients might still have a, a, a symptomatic dry eye disease, and then we have to to use more aggressive management plans. This could include like uh, uh, occluding their tear ducts or use a more uh, systematic treatment like, like a special anti-inflammatories, uh, oral treatment, or could be some other type of, of, uh, of uh, therapies. We use uh, uh, what you call it intense pulse light, IPL. This is a, a, a treatment to uh, address the functions of the oily glands inside the eyelids, and uh, it, it's proven to show, uh, to make a big improvement to patients' uh, tear film, which means make their dry eye better. There are obviously, uh, more and more uh, uh, lines of treatment coming and there's a lot of work now on dry disease management and we are keen all, always to adapt uh, the, the best, safest and evidence-based uh, treatments in our practice. Mm -hmm.